Imagine a weapon that can cross continents, unseen and unstoppable. It slips past enemy radar, silent and invisible, carrying enough firepower to change a conflict in a single mission. This is the world of the stealth bomber, the pinnacle of military aviation. In an age of satellites and advanced air defenses, striking without warning is the ultimate advantage. For nations that possess them, stealth bombers are the ultimate deterrent, a message that no target is safe. These aircraft are built to defeat the invisible walls of electronic surveillance, holding an enemy's most valued assets at risk deep within their territory. The psychological effect is immense, forcing adversaries to spend vast resources defending against a threat they cannot see. Only a handful of nations can dream of building such complex machines. Today, the exclusive club of stealth bomber operators is about to expand. The United States has long been the king of stealth, but now China's mysterious Xi'an H-20 is poised to challenge that dominance. This isn't just about two planes, it's about a shifting global balance of power played out in the silent deadly dance of stealth. The B-2 Spirit was born from Cold War fears, designed to penetrate the Soviet Union's formidable air defenses. Its radical flying wing design, developed in secrecy by Northrop, minimized its radar signature and changed the face of strategic bombing. Each B-2 cost over $2 billion, making it one of the most expensive military projects ever. The B-2's first flight in 1989 came just as the Cold War ended, but its role quickly evolved. It became America's weapon of choice for the opening strikes of any conflict, clearing the way for other forces. The B-2 proved its worth in Kosovo, Afghanistan, Iraq, and Libya flying marathon missions and striking high-value targets with precision. With only 20 aircraft, the B-2 is a rare asset, reserved for the most critical missions. Its crews are among the best trained in the Air Force, operating at the edge of technology. The B-2 is more than a bomber, it's a strategic weapon that redefined modern warfare. Sometimes, the most powerful presence is the one you never see. For years, the Xi'an H-20 was just a rumor, a Chinese stealth bomber to rival America's best. China's current bombers, like the H-6, lack range and stealth, limiting their strategic reach. The H-20 aims to change that, giving China the ability to strike far across the Pacific, threatening U.S. bases as distant as Guam or even Hawaii. This bomber is central to China's anti-access-slash-area denial strategy, making it risky for adversaries to operate near its shores. Official details are scarce, but glimpses reveal a flying wing design, prioritizing stealth above all. The H-20 is expected to be subsonic with long range and heavy payload, developed by Xi'an Aircraft Industrial Corporation. Its arrival marks China's entry into the elite club of nations with a true strategic bomber, signaling a major shift in the Indo-Pacific balance. The H-20 is more than a new plane. It's a statement of China's global ambitions. At the heart of this rivalry is stealth, the art of making an aircraft nearly invisible to radar. Conventional planes reflect radar waves lighting up screens, stealth bombers are designed to deflect and absorb those waves. The B-2's flying wing shape, smooth curves and hidden engines make it a master of low observability. Its radar-absorbent materials and even gold-coated cockpit windows help it evade detection. The Xi'an H-20, from what we know, follows a similar design philosophy, prioritizing stealth with its flying wing shape. Achieving true stealth is incredibly complex, requiring precision engineering and advanced materials. The B-2 stealth is so delicate, it needs climate-controlled hangars. America's decades of experience give the B-2 a proven edge. The H-20, as China's first stealth bomber, will likely be stealthy, especially from the front, but may not match the B-2's all-aspect invisibility. The real question, Will the H-20 be stealthy enough to bypass the defenses it's designed to defeat? In stealth, experience matters as much as design. The B-2 sets the standard, the H-20 aims to catch up. Stealth is vital, but a bomber's range and payload define its true power. The B-2 Spirit boasts an unrefueled range of about 6,000 nautical miles, enough to strike targets worldwide with just one refueling. Its payload up to 40,000 pounds of bombs or nuclear weapons, making it a cornerstone of America's nuclear triad. The H-20 specs are secret, but estimates suggest a range of at least 5,300 nautical miles, enough to reach U.S. bases in the Pacific from mainland China. 
Its projected payload is around 45,000 pounds, possibly favoring cruise missiles and nuclear options. On paper, both bombers are in the same league, with the B-2 excelling in global reach and the H-20 focused on the Indo-Pacific. The B-2 was built for worldwide power projection. The H-20 is designed to challenge U.S. dominance in its region. Both deliver a powerful punch over vast distances, but their strategic boxing rings are different. The B-2 is the global heavyweight. The H-20 is the regional contender. Each is tailored to its nation's military ambitions. The stakes control of the skies and the balance of power. Under the stealthy skin, avionics are the bomber's brain computers, sensors and communications that guide, target and defend. The B-2, though designed in the 1980s has been continuously upgraded with advanced fly-by-wire controls, GPS and passive sensors that detect threats without revealing its position. Its two-person crew manages complex missions with battle-tested systems. The H-20 will likely feature a modern glass cockpit, advanced data links, and powerful electronic warfare suites to jam or deceive enemy radars. Artificial intelligence may help its crew process information and make rapid decisions. The B-2's avionics are proven in combat. The H-20s are untested but could leapfrog older technology. The challenge for China integrating cutting-edge systems into a reliable, effective bomber. The B-2's strength is experience. The H-20s is potential. The real test will be in the skies, not on paper. Designing a stealth bomber is one thing, operating it in combat is another. The U.S. Air Force has flown the B-2 for over 30 years, amassing unmatched experience in maintenance, mission planning, and real-world operations. The B-2 has proven itself in Kosovo, Afghanistan, Iraq, and Libya, flying some of the longest and most complex bombing missions in history. This deep well of knowledge is a priceless advantage. In contrast, China has no experience operating a strategic stealth bomber. The H-20 will require new training, maintenance, and doctrine, a steep learning curve that takes years to master. The B-2's operational history gives it a decisive edge for now. China's journey with the H-20 is just beginning. So who wins the stealth bomber showdown? It's not about a single victor, but about understanding each plane's unique strengths. The B-2's edge is its proven reliability, unmatched stealth, and experienced crews. Its weakness, high cost, a small fleet, and aging technology. The H-20's strength is its potential, new technology, greater payload, and a leap in Chinese capability. Its weakness, it's unproven, and China lacks operational experience. The H-20 doesn't need to surpass the B-2 in every way. It just needs to be good enough to threaten key targets and shift the balance in the Pacific. For the US, the future is the B-21 Raider a next-generation stealth bomber designed for affordability and a larger fleet. The B-2 will serve alongside the B-21, but the focus is already shifting to the next chapter. The real contest is just beginning. The future of air power will be shaped by how these two titans compete. The Xi'an H-20's arrival ends America's monopoly on long-range stealth bombers. The global balance of air power is shifting, with two superpowers now able to strike each other's high-value targets from thousands of miles away. This new reality will spark a technological arms race, better radars, new missiles, and even directed energy weapons. For China, the H-20 is a symbol of rising power. For the US, it's a wake-up call to keep innovating. The B-21 Raider is America's answer, designed to meet the threats of the mid 21 st century. The competition is no longer theoretical, it's real, and it's accelerating. The B-2 and H-20 represent more than airplanes, they embody a new era of great power rivalry. As of August 2025, the skies are about to get more crowded and more contested. The great stealth bomber showdown is just beginning, the world will be watching, radar screens ready.